Hi, I'm Dr. Sean Van Winkle with Integrated Brain Centers in Denver, Colorado. We specialize in rehabilitating patients who have suffered from a traumatic brain injury. In this video, I'm going to share with you danger signs after a concussion that require immediate medical attention. A concussion can occur if you sustain a bump, blow, or jolt to the head or body. In rare cases, concussions and head injuries can lead to a blood clot in the brain. These blood clots can be dangerous as they occupy space that pushes against the brain, causing damage to the tissue. If not treated promptly, it can cause serious, and in some cases, permanent damage. If you or those around you note any of the following danger signs after you've had a head injury, contact your healthcare professional or emergency department right away. Some danger signs that you may become aware of include a headache that gets worse or does not go away. You may also experience weakness, numbness, or decreased coordination. Another sign you may notice is repeated vomiting or nausea, and finally, you may notice slurred speech. In some cases, these symptoms can occur without a bleed in the brain, but it is always necessary to have potential emergency situations ruled out right away. People that are checking in on you also need to be aware of some danger signs they may be able to observe. Any one of these should prompt them to treat the sign as an emergency and seek immediate medical attention. They may notice that you look very drowsy or that you cannot be awakened. Losing consciousness is also a serious matter, and even if it is very briefly, it should be monitored closely. They should also notice the size of your pupils, which is the black part of your eye. In most people, it is not normal to have one pupil larger than the other one, and this could be a significant danger sign. Convulsions and seizures are another symptom that require immediate attention. Finally, if they notice you are getting more and more confused, restless, agitated, or are displaying behavior that is unusual for you, they should take you to the emergency room. For children, all of the above signs are also an emergency situation. Depending on the age of the child, they may not be able to tell you how they are feeling. If they will not stop crying, cannot be consoled, cannot be nursed, or will not eat, you should take your child to the emergency room right away. Once you get them to the emergency room, you should expect them to check vitals and a series of neurological tests. Depending on the results of the tests, they may need to do imaging of the brain, such as a CT scan. This will help them see if there is a blood clot causing problems. If a fracture is suspected, they will do an x-ray. Remember, if you experience any of the above danger signs after a concussion, or if people keeping an eye on you notice any of them, it is important to go to the emergency room right away. If they rule out a serious structural problem at the emergency room, it is much more likely your symptoms are being caused by a functional problem. In other words, parts of your nervous system are not working the way they should. At Integrated Brain Centers, we are experts at understanding and rehabilitating functional brain problems. If you've been to the emergency room with any of the above danger signs and they've ruled out a serious problem, you should call our office today for a consultation to learn how we can help you recover.